you you'll be able to send energy to both players. I see a lot of Tempster uh, fans in the chat for the moment, but please give your energy to Kezi as well, because they're both really great players. They both deserve your attention and your support. And it's about to go down. Let's go. Yeah, tonight Tempster awesome. has a, a lot of support. Uh... Yeah, I've seen that in the chat. A lot of supporters for Tanster. And Kazzy playing fairly, fairly, uh, you know, defensive, trying to see what's going on. Now being a little more aggressive, now he's got Tanster in the corner. Finding the stun is the first round going to be a perfect. Oh my gosh, it is. Wow. That is one way to open an FT5, I'm telling you, with a perfect Kazi looking on fire tonight. Wow, confident Kazi. Uh, impressive Super confident, for the first round. Yeah. yeah, he was trying to be really defensive and see what was going on at first, but now he seems to, to have found his pace already, which is amazing because only one round has passed. And he seems really confident. Tamster. You know, looking a little lost, I think. Not really answering anything that Kazi is doing. Are we going for a double perfect on the first oh match? My god. Oh no. my god! No! <laughs> a double no. perfect on the first match. That is one opening. I was telling you guys, this FT5 was going to be amazing and it is already. Oh my gosh. If, wow. This is the first time we have a double perfect. Uh, it's the first on this time stream. we have a double perfect. Yeah, exactly. It's the first time we have a double perfect. I wonder what's going through Tamster's head right now. Is he going to counter pick? What's going on? Okay. Is Tamster counter picking? Could that be? I wonder if it has a second character then. Because I know about uh, his Colleen for sure, but I uh, haven't heard of uh, any other character. In fact, they uh, sent me a message that uh, the connection looks very. Oh. Bad. Very bad? Very Just... shaky? Yeah. Oh, okay. God. So, guys, what do you want to do? Do you want to continue? So. Do you want to try <laughs> something else, maybe? Oh, Tamster's trying again. He's inviting Casey again. Okay. Well, let's okay, see let's what's going again. on. Yeah. Okay. Maybe the connection was a little shaky at first. I'm really praying it's not a server issue on Capcom's side because that would be terrible for us. Is there any maintenance tonight or this week? No, I not heard. I don't that. think so. But you know, sometimes the uh, the servers go down for some reason, or the connection overall is pretty bad. You know. Those servers, they have their bad days, essentially, and for some reason, sometimes you'll have the perfect connection no matter where your opponent is, and sometimes your connection is going to be super bad. So I hope it's not that. I hope it's just just a connection problem right. on one of the player's side. I really hope it's that, and I hope Tamster is able to play somewhat. <laughs> Il n'y a pas d'excuse pour un WP. Après, il n'avait pas l'air de euh, oui, euh, je, se laisser je faire. Euh, euh, faire. Non, non, mais je, je, je trouvais quand même le, le jeu de, de Tamster. Ah, voilà, ça par contre, c'est du Wiff Punish, de la belle anticipation sur ce dragon EX. On espère que la connexion va un peu mieux du côté de Tamster. Ça a l'air d'être un peu mieux. Hein. On voit un Tamster beaucoup plus euh, serein, beaucoup plus offensif. Voilà, ça trouve le. Le jab en air to air, le stun, voilà, setup avec le glaçon, un gros, oh, beau reset dans le coin, je pensais qu'il allait, qu allait aller le pour le full damage, même, le petit chimie qui va bien, et voilà. Bon, ça a l'air d'aller mieux, hein. du côté de Tamster, on voit que... Euh... Ouais, qu'il a repris des couleurs. Que, euh... Voilà, il a repris un petit peu des couleurs, ça va mieux, la connexion est peut-être meilleure. En tout cas, on a vu un, un, un deuxième round, un, pardon, un, un deuxième match, un début de deuxième match beaucoup plus rassurant. Bonsoir ça Sultitus, va. notre Bonsoir, français Sultitus. le plus anglais. <rire> Alors, qu'est-ce que tu penses de, de ce match-up, euh, Liv Tu penses qu'il y a plus un avantage sur Ken ou plutôt Colin Alors, euh, Ken, bon, malheureusement, euh, il, a, il a subi eh ben, des, des nerfs hein, au fil des saisons. C'était un, un, un perso qui était plutôt euh, viable au début et qui maintenant, euh, malheureusement, euh, et bah, euh, a un peu de mal hein, à se faire de la place euh, sur la scène compétitive, notamment parce que bah, si vous voulez jouer un Shoto, vous avez euh, largement mieux hein, à votre disposition dans le jeu, que ce soit Akuma ou Sakura par exemple. 
pour ce qui est de Colline, euh, c'est un perso euh, solide qu'on voit de plus en plus hein, sur euh, la scène compétitive. Plus en plus, en plus de Colline, très très solide. Je pense notamment à Sato Momochi par exemple. Et euh, bah, c'est un match-up que j'ai pas franchement l'habitude de voir. Ces deux persos qui ont, qui ont deux plans de jeu très très différents. Et, et pour connaître un peu euh, le, le Ken de Kazé, euh, c'est un Ken très 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 agressif. Donc, oh, ça a redragonné du bon côté J'espère que vous l'avez tous vu. Ça a redragonné ouais, du mauvais ouais. côté, mais ça a redragonné du bon côté. Ouais. Autocorrect. Euh... Autocorrect. Auto, auto, euh, street... <rire> voilà, Autocorrect Street Fighter 5 esque Ça arrive souvent. Hein. C'est pas. C'est pas exclusif à, à Ken, hein. ça, ça arrive très souvent ces histoires d'autocorrect. Mais euh, euh, du coup, et donc pour, pour revenir sur le, le Ken de Kazé, c'est un, un Ken particulièrement agressif euh, qui, euh, qui joue eh bien, beaucoup dans l'offensive et qui va euh, essayer euh, autant que faire se peut d'asphyxier euh, son adversaire pour vraiment pas lui laisser le temps de réfléchir. Quoi et euh, Colin, perso, euh, beaucoup, sur le beaucoup chat, plus euh, lent. Que se passe-t-il On a Will Tupac qui vient de follow la chaîne Bienvenue à toi, Will Tupac Bienvenue à toi, on à toi Bonsoir Pardon, je t'ai coupé Non, non, aucun souci Non, mais il faut célébrer l'arrivée d'invité de Marc sur la chaîne Ça se célèbre Mais donc, ouais, Colin a un perso beaucoup plus Oh, ça c'était très très bien joué par contre Alors, une utilisation du V-Trigger de Colin que je n'avais encore jamais vu euh, utiliser donc ce dash spécial qu'elle obtient euh, en V-Trigger 2 et ensuite voilà faire un back dash pour faire whiffer euh, la tentative de punish de Kazé c'est très très malin, très bien joué mais euh, du coup voilà euh, Colin un perso euh, beaucoup plus euh, lent, un perso euh, féminin assez lent hein. on n'a plus l'habitude de voir des, des persos féminins lents mais en l'occurrence c'est le cas et un perso euh, vraiment euh, assez technique et qui euh, va beaucoup jouer bah, dans, dans l'approche, dans la dans euh, le contrôle euh, du terrain, dans le whiff punish, avec des boutons qui vont quand même assez loin. Ah, ça donc, donne des conseils euh... hein, sur le chat là, Apex Predator euh, ouais, ouais. Duck mm -hmm. qui conseille euh, ouais. Tamster. Ah mais c'est bien. On voit que les, les joueurs ont du soutien dans le chat, c'est beau. I don't think Samster uh, is reading uh, the chat, but uh, thank you Apex Predator yeah. uh, for uh, <laughs> your sure advice he, uh, to him. I'm not sure he has time to read the chat. He's probably very busy at the moment trying to uh, find a solution, find uh, something to do about Kazi's pressure, because Kazi's looking really, really good right now. So I'm not sure he has time to read the chat. That's not gonna kill, but that pro will do it. But yeah, thank you guys in the chat for sending your energy to the players. It's always appreciated, even though they probably don't have time to read you guys. But I'm sure they can feel your, your support in some way. Bienvenue euh, à Vicario, hein, qui vient d'arriver sur le, bienvenue, sur bienvenue. le stream. Hein. Salut, salut. Installez-vous tous, mettez-vous bien. Voilà, très bon, euh, très bon confirme là, de, de Tapster. C'est là un, un peu plus, un peu plus équilibré. Oh, c'est dommage par contre, ce cutter qui passe dans le vent. Tout de suite très bien puni par Kazé qui va trouver euh, l'avantage du coin. Un avantage qui positionné qu'il a bien réussi à trouver et qui met euh, Colin dans une situation euh, quand même assez, euh, assez embarrassante. Bon heureusement qu'avec euh, du coup, donc, comme j'en parlais, ce dash spécial en mode trigger 2, ça a permis quand même à Tamster de récupérer un peu euh, le contrôle du centre, mais là ça a fait un peu euh, balade d'un coin à l'autre, malheureusement. Oh, très très bon, euh, très très bon, oui, par contre, ça, ça punit tout de suite. Hein. Vous voyez, je vous parlais des, des boutons qui vont loin hein, chez Colline. Et encore une fois, un hein, whiff punish, ça va vraiment être euh, une arme euh, très importante. Hein, On voit beaucoup euh, de Colline à utiliser, ça fait partie de, de leur stratégie pour gérer le match. Donc, euh, donc très important, euh, de bien, euh, bien whiff punish, profiter de la distance des coups de Colline. Welcome, chez quand même on the stream. Hi, Chips, welcome. Do you think uh, Tamster is still complaining of the connection that's true with friends wow. and... Oh, and that's UK. not punished. Maybe that's a connection issue, because that should have been punished by Kazi. They keep playing for the moment, so I'm assuming Tamster thinks the connection is okay, and I'm, I'm, I'm assuming it's okay on both sides, because else they would have stopped and they probably would have sent you a message by now. So I'm assuming everything's okay as long as they keep playing. And hopefully it gets better with time and hopefully the first match with the wacky connection was just an accident. 
Okay, dude, critical doesn't doesn't kill, but uh, yeah, this it kick, didn't kill, but yeah, this kill it'll kick, do. Okay. Uh, my question is though, what do we do about the first match with the wacky bad connection? Do we still count it or? Yeah, because there's not? no uh, there's no title, there's no. Okay, so it's three zero at no the trophy. moment for Kazi. So it's three zero at the moment for Kazi. Kazi looking really good, really strong. Round one. My God, he's really on fire, just as he should be as a Ken player, you know. But yeah, Tamster having some trouble. I mean, it's not completely, you know, one-sided. It's not, you know, one player has the advantage and the other one doesn't do anything about it. I wish we would see a little bit more anti-airs uh, on Tamster's side because I've seen Kazi for the moment really, you know, trying his chance at you know, exactly that, jumping on Tamster see if he's gonna react. He has tested Tamster's entires multiple times now. See, they're not there and takes the event takes advantage of that for sure. And Tamster will be triggered too. That's punishable, but he still doesn't get it. That is really weird. Maybe that's a connection issue after all. Because that should be punishable and punished. And we see Kazi try to go for it, but it just doesn't work. It doesn't Oh, no. oh and the throw! Wow. <laughs> Time still have the okay. chance to get the, the round, but this time he's... Yeah, he it's it. pretty close every time, but yeah, every time Kazi finds, you know, some some sort of way to keep Tamster in the corner, whether it's on, you know, the left side or right side, he tries and always finds a way to keep him in the corner and to just stop him from uh, from applying Colleen's pressure or, his, or her... Um, with punish play or game in, in any way so yeah Kazi's really good at controlling the match right now although things are not looking too bad for Kazi at the moment pretty bad to have put your himself in the corner there pretty unlucky but that should do nice damage here another feature trigger too but that wake up DP though <laughs> very Ken player like Serré, là, en de, ouais 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 de tous de les, les rounds sont serrés hein. c'est jamais euh, c'est jamais trop euh... oh très beau oui. très très beau euh, très très beau chimie mais euh, oui c'est toujours assez serré hein. on a on a pour l'instant bon, à part le, le, le premier le, le premier match d'ouverture euh, qui a été complètement euh, en faveur de Kazé on n'a pas euh, vraiment de, euh, de match ou de round complètement euh, à l'avantage d'un joueur sans que l'autre ne puisse rien faire, c'est toujours assez serré pour l'instant. Ah, très très beau, euh, très très beau contre IX. Et pour l'instant, voilà, on, trouve, euh, on a un jeu assez équilibré, même si euh, pour l'instant c'est plutôt Kazé qui trouve les ressources nécessaires à chaque fois pour aller euh, conclure les rounds et les matchs. Ah, c'est dommage pour Tamster, il a cherché l'overhead là pour. Euh... Ouais, 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 mais c'est lui qui se fait stun, en fait. Voilà, et ça ah, va tuer. Qu'est-ce que c'est dommage. Ouais, c'est vraiment dommage. On, on sent que, que Tamster vraiment euh, trouve euh, les bonnes ouvertures, sait comment euh, pousser Kazé euh, à la faute, et pourtant, il a vraiment toujours du mal à, à conclure les rounds et à conclure les matchs, donc c'est un peu dommage. Peut-être est-il un peu pressé sur les fins de rounds, justement. Wake pressé up, Tamster, you, you represent UK on the light uh, weight. So, come on! It's 4 0 now. 4 0. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Yeah, it's, it's looking pretty bad for Tempster at the moment. I hope he finds something uh, in this round, in this match, because that's, that's pretty much his last chance there. Because after that, if Kazi wins, it's over. So, I hope for him he finds something to do. Very nice with polish and Tapster looking very good. Whenever uh, he's in, uh, he's in uh, a comfortable uh, position with Colleen. He's very good at uh, controlling, uh, controlling the distance, controlling uh, the rhythm of the match as well. Another absence of entire there, pretty unfortunate, but. You know, whenever he's at a comfortable distance from Kazi, he's looking much more confident, using his Vitrigger 2 to go through the fireball game of Kazi. Very nice. And now Kazi has to fight his way outside the corner. Tamster looking good. 
see what Kazi can do, but it's looking very difficult. Oh, and the air to air, very nice. Yeah, nice Kazi looking much more confident on this uh, on this last match. Hopes he finds some kind of momentum to keep keep it going. Good anticipation doesn't connect though, and. Yeah, very. He oh, he's also Tamster doing a very good job at uh, interrupting uh, Ken's run because that's what that's something Kazi is, is very good at using to put pressure on his opponent using the the run animation from Ken, the run move, and that's something that Tamster has really adapted to. He's he's adapted really well and he's very good at uh, at interrupting that. He's also very good at making uh, Kazi's uh, DP whiff, but he doesn't really manage to punish him afterwards, so that's kind of unfortunate. But we've, we've so seen him use... Yeah, 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 it's very good. Oh, making that safe. A throw can do it, oh, put him on. in the corner. Come on, Tansu, very coffee, on, coffee on the realm. <laughs> okay, he's out of the corner now with, his, with a, a, a clever use of his V-Trigger 2. That is looking so scary for both players right now. It's so 24 close. 24 seconds left, Liv. 24 seconds. Come second. on. And you see, I was I was telling you uh, earlier about how those two characters are very different in how they approach a match. And look, it's going to go till time over, maybe. Oh my gosh. It's lasting so long and it's going to go Come till on. time over. Taps are chasing. Oh, after. Come on. Oh, oh my no. gosh. Time over. So you see, two very different characters. One that's very rushed down and aggressive, and the other one who's taking a little bit more her time. And that's another very good whiff punish of a whiffed DP. And Tamster is actually very good at that. And Kazi's been falling for it over and over again. It seems maybe he doesn't really know this strategy, and he's not, you know, he's not really adapting to it. Yeah, he's gonna save Tamster his match points. Tamster with them. What's it gonna be? How much damage can he deal? A throw maybe? No? Ooh, this is so close. And Isis doesn't hit uh, when he escapes uh, from the corner. That's no, strange. no, no. It didn't. Well, yeah, it's strange. That sucks. I wonder why. <laughs> that really sucks. Ooh, that throw! Is Kazi able to make a comeback here? That would be huge! Okay, Tams is at the corner now. Nasty. What's he gonna do? <laughs> it's gonna be nasty. Oh no. This is <laughs> a drama. And this is looking super close. It was all for Tamster oh earlier. My oh my god! god. <laughs> wow! I so oh no. believe. No parry, I so no believe. I so believe Tamster was gonna do it. I so believe he yeah, was I gonna so. save that match. I Oh my god, this is heartbreaking! <laughs> I really thought Tamster was gonna make it! And what a comeback from Kazi! Playing super patient. Playing super, super patient. Yeah, GG, Very uh, nice Tamster. GG, GG Kazi, uh, pretty solid. Kazi, super no, strong. No mercy. Very impressed. No Kaze, mercy. Oh, no, not at all. First strike, first hard. Uh, strike hard, first strike. No mercy. Yeah, no mercy. Not at all. So we have a, a little bit of time to interview uh, uh, yeah, sure. the, the players. Okay, Kaze, um, Tamster, can you join the yeah the vocal channel for a quick uh, interview with Liv and uh, Andy? Yeah, sure, please, please join Don't us. Don't worry, guys, it's just a combat. FT5 is friendly, friendly FT5. Yeah. No shame, no record on Twitter. Absolutely not. No, no, no. We're not in that kind of atmosphere. No way. But I, I do have questions to ask, though, because <laughs> questions need to be asked there. <laughs> wow, that was pretty unexpected. I, I really believed uh, that Colleen was going to be the answer in that matchup, honestly. Given how strong she's been lately and given how impressive uh, oh, all, the, yeah. all the Colleen players are, I really thought she had a, cho a chance. But honestly, what a job! From Kazi, what a strong play! Uh, incredible, oh, I'm really impressed. Yeah. So please, guys, join us. 
Yeah, exactly. Just like uh, Sir Claude said, no worries, Tim. Just a bad night. It happens. Oh, it absolutely yeah. happens. There are such things as bad rounds, bad matches, bad FTs even. Sometimes it's just you not know, your day. You know what, Liv, Tamster, Kaze? What happened in Challenge FT5? Stay in Challenge FT5. <laughs> no worry. <laughs> salut, Kaze. Bonsoir. Bonsoir, Kaze. Salut. Euh, bah, GG à GG, toi hein, déjà. Combat, ouais, ah bah, bravo. Bravo, bravo. Moi ça, ça laguait pas mal. Ah d'accord. Bah justement ouais, c'était une que des questions que je voulais, euh, que je voulais poser. Ouais 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 bah c'est je crois Tamster euh, le premier qui disait que la connexion était pas optimale. Du ouais, coup ouais, on bah, espère que. que depuis trois coup... barres j'ai dit à faire Dan ouais trois barres ça va être chaud. Mm -hmm. Bon après s'il y avait des TP bon c'était quand même jouable mais ouais il y avait pas mal de TP. Mais euh, ouais bah du coup on espère que, que c'était euh, simplement, malheureusement, euh, un problème de connexion euh, d'un côté ou de l'autre pour vous et que ce ne sont pas les serveurs de chez Capcom qui sont en train de nous ouais, lâcher. Bon, pas savoir, ouais. Donc je, je croise les doigts personnellement. <rire> Mais en tout cas, ouais, vraiment, euh, GG à toi, euh, Kazé. On Après le match, c'était sympa. Euh... En plus, je connaissais pas Colline. D'accord, bah c'est bah, bien que euh... j'anticipe mes questions. <rire> Parce que du coup, on t'a vu euh, pas mal de fois. Euh... Euh, à la fois trouver justement les bonnes stratégies pour, euh, pour conclure les rounds et conclure les matchs là où Tamster avait un petit peu plus de mal et en même temps euh, on t'a vu plusieurs fois euh, tomber euh, dans le piège euh, qui, de, de l'arnaque de Colin qui fait wiffer les, les dragons ah ouais. et euh, du coup j'allais te poser la question de, de ta connaissance du match-up justement euh... je connais pas du tout le match-up je me suis entraîné un peu avec euh, Charlie Yep je sais pas si tu Ben Mo oui Ben Mo euh, oui, euh, Charlie ben Yep Mo, sur, oui. Euh, sur Twitch ouais. et Ben Mo sur euh... Ouais, ouais. La bon, montance, quoi. Il m'a ouais, exactement. Et il m'a bon, il m'a appris les, les punitions de base, quoi, les mid 1, 4, 1, 5, 1, 6, les coups ouais, safe, 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 etc. On a on a révisé ça juste il euh, y a une heure ou deux là avant le match. <rire> C'est les, les ouais, révisions de dernière minute. Ça m'a bien servi. Ça m'a permis de garder les comment dire les devants derrière. Euh, oui. Le ouais, micro, ouais, c'est une grosse photo, hein, je vois sur le Twitch. Oui, euh, Grosse qui s'extasie sur, euh, sur ta photo de profil, casé euh, un montage. Euh... Oh, ah, de photo. De euh... <rire> ah, je sais plus qui c'est qui a fait cette photo, c'est un joueur des CF4, je m'en rappelle plus de son nom, qui a fait ce montage euh, magnifique. <rire> Mais ouais, sinon, ouais, le, le FT il était cool, hein, franchement. Ouais, ouais, euh, dommage, euh, que, euh, dommage, dommage que la connect. Euh... Ouais, malheureusement, bah, c'est les aléas de, de Street Fighter 5. Euh, merci à Charlie Yep, hein. bah, justement, mon entraîneur, il est là. <rire> est ah, bah. Merci à lui. Hein. Yeah, Tamster, if you can uh, join us on the Discord, yeah, please plug join your microphone us. and share your feedback. Uh, We'd love Kaze to, to have you. And us uh, are waiting for you, but we can start with uh, Kaze. Je sais pas si t'as d'autres questions, uh, Liv. Euh, oui, alors j'en avais une, parce que du coup, je, je, on avait commencé par ça euh, pour introduire euh, votre FT5. Euh, et je disais justement que, bon, niveau, euh, niveau Shoto, il y avait quand même mieux que Ken dans le jeu. Et du coup, je voulais savoir, euh, toi, Kazé, ce qui te plaisait tant, en fait, dans le fait de jouer Ken, si tu avais quelque chose qui, qui te plaisait particulièrement euh, pour que tu continues de le jouer euh, bah Après, moi, je le joue par défaut, ça a toujours été mon main. D'accord. Genre... Depuis Street perso 2. du cœur. Euh... Ouais, voilà, depuis Street 2, j'ai toujours joué Ken. Oh, c'est sur... une très bonne raison. Hein. Sur Street 3, sur Street... dès que j'ai vu Ken sur Street 4, je me suis dit, bon, bah voilà, j'ai déjà mon perso. Mm -hmm. J'ai essayé, oui, bah. peu... essayé de taffer un peu Ryu, Akuma, les autres Shoto. D'accord. Je trouve pas la même dynamique qu'avec Ken. Donc plutôt joueur, euh, joueur spécialiste de Shoto euh, dans ton cas, donc. Euh, ouais. Je joue un peu de Chun-Li aussi. En fait, mes ah. deux persos principaux, c'est Ken et Chun-Li. D'accord. Et euh, Chun-Li, ce qu'elle est speed aussi. Les oui, oui, oui. Et, euh, les... Elle a des combos assez split, donc j'aime bien. Mais Ken, c'est plus. Euh... Bah, il a un bon Shoryu. Il a le Shoryu qui va le plus loin du jeu. Pour moi, c'est le bon Shoryu. Okay, je vais juste traduire un petit peu en anglais et... euh, sur les premières euh, questions. Oui. Euh, ok, so the, the first question that uh, we had to Kaze was uh, uh, What was his uh, feeling about this combat? So he replied that uh, Yeah, the, the connection was pretty bad, uh, pretty laggy. But uh, okay, there's, he, he could play, and uh, pretty sure that Tamster also complained about about it. Second question was, um, what is his uh, f uh, knowledge of, uh, of the matchup? Colin uh, can, well, he Kaze doesn't know a lot the the matchup of 
Colini just trained a little bit with uh, one of these mate uh, Benmo. Perhaps he can apply to this uh, lightweight category. And uh, okay, Benmo said to him, uh, "What uh, what special uh, special hit or uh, hit uh, his minus or plus?" So this is how he, he could train a, a little bit. And the last question was uh, maybe not the last question, but uh, what, do you, what does he think about the, the character Ken? So Kaze uh, decided to, to play Ken because this is a character that he likes uh, pretty much. He also has a, a Chun Li uh, character because uh, she's a speedy, she's a very fast character. No oh, attempts to finally you there. Thank you very much for for coming and and for accepting to to answer our questions. So first of all, GGs. I know it wasn't probably a very easy of a of an FT5, but so my first question would uh, probably be regarding the the connection because you were the first uh, to to uh, let us know about the the connection issues. How? How much did it impact your gameplay or, or your game plan? And that's that. If Tabster can, he can hear me. Tabster, we, we can't hear you. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. You can't hear me? Ah, uh, yes. Perfect. Ah, finally oh, okay. we can hear you. Perfect. Yeah, 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 Thank yeah. you. Alright, brilliant. Yeah, awesome. Um, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, first, um, GG's to um, Kazi. Thanks for having me on as well. Um, so I appreciate that. GG's um, too. Yeah, the connection, oh, obviously, Kazi will yeah. say the same thing. I, I assumed he said That's the same thing. Really bad. It's rough. Yeah, really bad connection. Yeah. Literally. Three, it's a three bar. It, you know. it wasn't showing. So. It wasn't showing at all at all for us, but we, we do believe you guys. It, it can be terrible at times. Yeah, and that's no one's fault. That's just CFN, you know. Yeah, uh, because what, that's this, just how what, it is. UK and France, it should be fine, but you know, sometimes but it's it not. <laughs> CFN, <laughs> exactly, is CFN. Exactly. Uh, yeah, that's that's H. just the way it is at this point. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, exactly. For sure. Uh, my second question uh, would be about the Colleen Ken matchup. Uh, probably so in, in in two parts. The first thing, uh, which is, uh, what is your knowledge of this matchup and uh what do you think of colleen in this matchup do you think she has the advantage the advantage or does she struggle it, at times it's in colleen's favor for sure um easily i used to play ken i've played more ken than colleen actually so um, oh interesting okay yeah it was my first main I've put, uh, right. so like yeah it's, it's definitely in her favor um the only thing ken has is really like a fireball so you can play the game a little bit further but otherwise um yeah it's completely in colleague's favor um footsie tool she has back heavy kick uh stand heavy punch crouch medium kick. it keeps her out keeps him out pretty easily so um yeah it's definitely in her favor yeah for sure and uh so um my next question would be so you you, you said that uh ken was your first main actually i didn't know about that but that that makes me want to ask you this question even more which is uh why did you switch for colleen then what do you like so much about colleen that made you switch so i play quite a few characters um okay. before season four drop season five yeah season four dropped sorry um i played karen um who i made super diamond with and then okay. i haven't been playing much recently because i just did my masters so i was busy doing that um I and then understand. after karen uh, got nerfed i was like i wanted to pick another character so <laughs> i just picked up um colleen i thought she fit me quite well um just being able to play a slow game i prefer playing the slow yeah. game just trying to put out poke my opponent um so, so you prefer to play a slow game which is interesting for a ken main to me because ken's pre is pre a pretty uh speedy <laughs> character actually that's yeah that's true i mean i picked ken because um i only street Fighter five is my first game i only picked up okay. uh what at uni at 2018 i think i bought it then when arcade edition dropped um okay. so i was like ken or ryu i'm gonna pick ken because he's got fire on the show you can that's cool <laughs> so there you go time flies uh leave uh another question or it's okay uh no I i'm done for the moment but so thank you very much guys it was awesome having you two we'll probably just translate in french uh so that our french uh viewers can understand 
Euh, donc oui, rapidement en français, j'ai posé plusieurs questions à Tamster. Euh, la première euh, qui était donc concernant la connexion et sa, sa réponse a été la même que Kazé, c'est-à-dire que bah, malheureusement, euh, voilà, le CFN, on connaît hein, et parfois la connexion peut être vraiment terrible. Donc ça restait jouable, mais c'était quand même assez particulier. Euh, ma deuxième question, du coup, euh, était concernant le match-up Ken Collin, euh, ce qu'il ce qu en pensait, euh, s'il pensait que c'était plutôt en faveur de Collin ou non. Et euh, donc ce que je ne savais pas, c'est qu'en fait, Tamster jouait Ken avant, donc il connaît bien les, les deux, les deux le perso et pour lui c'est clairement à l'avantage de Colin donc notamment grâce à ce que je disais donc ces boutons qui, qui vont loin et qui permet qui permettent à Colin de, de bien contrôler la range à laquelle se, se joue le match et enfin du coup donc ma dernière question était de savoir pourquoi en tant qu'ancien main Ken il avait décidé de switcher pour Colin et euh, du coup il a, il a joué plusieurs persos au, au fil du temps euh, sur le jeu. Euh, Karine, euh, d'abord, avec laquelle il a obtenu donc, son euh, super diamant, et puis ensuite, quand elle s'est fait nerf, elle, il a décidé de changer, et euh, Colin euh, lui plaisait bien, parce que c'est voilà, un perso assez lent, avec lequel on peut, on peut un peu prendre son temps, et, et, et ça lui plaisait bien. Ce qui est assez surprenant dans, de la part d'un ancien mannequin, d'ailleurs. <rire> mais, euh, mais en tout cas, s'il si, si a pu trouver un, un perso qui lui convient, c'est très bien. Donc voilà. En tout cas, bah, merci messieurs, thank you very much. Thank you very merci much, much Tamster, uh, thank you uh, Kaze, uh, and now. Yeah, thanks for me. See you guys, bye. Now we're gonna, we're gonna switch to the next uh, next combat. So the next bonne combat leave. Hein. Yes, uh, bonne chance à Yves, yeah. hein, oui. de la part de, de Kaze. Ah, c'est gentil. Merci, merci, euh, salut, merci Kaze. Allez, on va regarder ça. <rire> ouais. Alors, du euh, coup. bah écoute. Oh, je vais lancer le trailer. Let's let's play the trailer to, to get the hype to, to introduce uh, Elix and uh, Apollo Steve. 